This is Gary Gaiman with the Dominate the Day podcast. The purpose of this podcast is to help you get 1% better in your business, provide clarity, and give you some ideas that will help you grow your business. If you're ready to dominate the day, let's go. Dominate the day, that's what we're about to do. If you don't want to dominate, then this podcast ain't for you. But if you are, then keep listening. Because every single damn day, the mission is, it's to dominate. You already know. We're here to dominate the day. So if you want to dominate every day, then let's go. It's time to grow. This is another episode of Dominate the Day. Dominate Nation. It's that time. It's time to dominate today. You know what time it is. Talking about building a team, and uh, I know I know a lot of people struggle with this. And um, you know, we're talking about identification and that selection process. But I want to talk to you about the hiring process and your specific hiring process. So, at Dominate Partners, what we do is you know, we start with ads in different places: Indeed, Facebook, LinkedIn. Uh, and we get responses. And when we get a response, if they follow what the ad says, then we'll take it to the next level. Most of the time, the ad says to email a resume to this email address. And most people like to apply on the platform. I don't like the application on the platform. It's it's a pain in the butt. I want to get the want to get the resume. I want to be able to talk to them. Um, and you know, like for instance, on Indeed, they mask the contact information unless the person is willing to show it. Well, I want to be able to pick the phone up and call somebody or email somebody. And so we require people to email us a resume. We tell them where to send it to. Um, and if they follow that, we go to the next step, especially if we like the resume. We select the resume. Next thing we do is we send them um, we send them an assessment on the job that they're going to be doing. A lot of stuff we do here is technical, so we're going to send them an assessment that tells us if they have the technical expertise to do this job, if they get above a passing score for that, they go to the next step, which is a video interview. And basically we use a service, sends out a link. They click on the link from their phone. They hear a question. They respond to the question in the video and we get to see them and hear them. Why is that important? Well, I want to know that they are able to communicate. And I want to know that we're not talking to Jeffrey Dahmer uh, reincarnated. I want to I want to see this individual, right? So what do we ask? Well, we ask questions that are um, open ended, not yes or no, and we don't ask questions like "Tell us why we should hire you because you're so great." Like that's all bullshit. I want them. I want to try to get truth out of them. So I ask them open ended questions about things that really don't have anything to do with the job, but they have to do with how they can communicate. For instance, one of our questions is what superpower do you possess and it's a trick question because i don't want to hear about your superpower related to the job and that's what they answer those people usually i'm not necessarily going to be interested in interviewing or they better have killed the technical assessment so i interview them right because i don't want to hear the bullshit what i want to hear is i want to hear you tell me what your superpower is so it could go one of two ways. It could be a legit superpower. Like my superpower is persistence. I don't give up. But also I'm Batman. Like I don't have a superpower. I'm Batman. How do you know I'm Batman? Well, ask yourself this question. Have you seen me and Batman in the same room before? You haven't. You have not. I promise you because I'm motherfucking Batman. Right. I want to hear I, I want to hear people talk to you to 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 me in a story way. So I know they, they know how to take complex situations and break them down. That's why asking that question helps us see who are we dealing with here. Are you just trying to bullshit us and schmooze us? Or are you truly trying to answer the question? Um, so that's why we ask that question. The next question is, um, what do you know about Dominate Partners? <laughs> just plain and simple. What do you know about us? Right. Next, the one of the final questions we ask is, um, what is it that you like about this job offering from Dominate Partners. We want to know. We want to know. And you, know, you can tell when somebody is uh, feeding you fluff, giving you a line. I get it. But at the same time, we want to see how they communicate, how they're able to kind of pivot and give you give you answers to questions so that you know you're dealing with somebody who's legit so you can add them to your team, dominate the market, and dominate the day. Dom- 
dominate the day That's what we're about to do If you don't wanna dominate Then this podcast ain't for you But if you are, then keep listening Cause every single damn day The mission is It's to dominate You already know We're here to dominate the day So if you wanna dominate Every day Then let's go, it's time to grow This is another episode of Dominate the day